Hello guys, this is a quick video to answer one question which I received on the channel as what exactly is grokking and I thought uh, maybe I will also mention this new research around grok fast as part of that answer. So let's begin. Grokking is a recently discovered process where generalization is achieved long after a model overfits to the training data. This process was first reported by a few researchers in a previous paper which I mentioned a few days back for a two-layer transformer trained using a simple algorithmic data set. And then uh, later it was learned that similar artifacts were observed for various model architectures trained with a variety of data sets including images, languages and graphs. So if you ask in a, in a very simple words, grokking is a process where model generalizes long after overfitting and that requires excessive iterations making it impractical due to high computation cost so in order to understand the phenomena or process of grokking we need to understand what exactly is meant by overfitting so overfitting happens when a model is trained too much or too well on a specific data set and becomes overly specialized resulting in poor performance on any new unseen data so whatever model knows from its training data it knows too well to learn anything else this happens when a model is too complex and learns the noise and random fluctuations in the training data rather than the underlying patterns as a result the model performs exceptionally well on training data but struggles to generalize and make accurate predictions on new data and that limits its usefulness in real world application because most of these large language models especially the base ones we expect them to be generalized and not overly fitted on a specific data set so this is where grokking happens when generalization is achieved long after a model overfits to the generator uh, to the training data and the grok fast algorithm which you can see on your screen accelerates this grokking by 50 percent so the grok fast algorithm accelerates this by amplifying slow varying gradients using low pass filters either moving average which is called as grok fast ma or exponential moving average that is called as grok fast ema this technique is easily implemented with a few lines of code which you can see here so you would need to include it as part of your optimizer call during training and all you need to do is to just download the grokpass.py from this repo which i will drop the link in video's description you can just get it with wget download it and then import the helper function of grokfast and then simple insert this following line before the training loop and then between the loss dot backward or optimizer step just insert any of these lines so this will go into the optimization loop and there are two options you can just include it here this one which have the arguments like alpha and lambda, and this is related to of course to the training and then this is option two but i would go with this option and then you can just call the optimizer and then it carries on the training so that is all there is to it in order to make sure that um, you implement grok fast that accelerates the grokking by up to 50 times across diverse tasks and that reduces the impacts of overfitting and that includes images languages graphs and so it is also going to reduce your training um, budget your training time your training resources so that is what grok fast does that is what grokking is and that is what overfitting is so i hope that i was able to answer it let me know what do you think if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel and if you're already subscribed then please share it among your network as it helps a lot thanks for watching